Diving with the Oceanic Atom 3.0 is very easy. In this video we will take you for a dive with the Oceanic Atom 3.0 dive computer. But first we will review its planning capabilities. While in surface mode, you can access the Atom 3.0 pre-dive planning sequence. This is a tool that allows you to plan the maximum bottom time for your dive based on the expected depth. The pre-dive planning sequence provides a sequence of theoretical dive times available for depths ranging from 30 feet to 190 feet. To access the pre-dive planning sequence from surface mode, press the advance button until you see the plan lead-in screen. Let's look at the plan lead-in screen when diving air. This display contains the following information. PZ plus icon if in use, message plan, FO2 setting, and tank in use icon. Press the select button to enter the pre-dive planning sequence. Then press the advance button to increase the plan depth, or press the mode button to decrease the plan depth. Note that the planning mode takes into consideration information from previous dives such as residual nitrogen, dive profiles in a series of repetitive dives, and oxygen toxicity when diving nitrox. Okay, enough talking. Time to get wet. We are diving at Shiprock in Catalina Island, California, and our objective for this dive is to explore the wall located southeast of Shiprock. The base of the wall is at 130 feet, but we will limit our maximum depth to 110 feet. According to the Atom 3.0 planning sequence, we should limit our dive time to 13 minutes. My buddy is ready. Let's descend. As soon as you descend deeper than 5 feet, the Atom 3.0 will enter no decompression dive mode. When diving air, no decompression dive mode has a main display plus one alternate display. To cycle between the two displays, just press the advance button. While diving, it is good practice to monitor your dive computer every few minutes. We are almost at the wall. We reached our target depth. Let's cruise around the wall and look for marine life. Hmm. The nitrogen loading bar is almost in the caution zone, and we are getting close to our planned bottom time. Let's signal the buddy to head back to the boat and make a safe ascent. While ascending, it is important to monitor the variable ascent rate indicator. Upon ascending to 20 feet on any no decompression dive in which the depth exceeded 30 feet, the Atom 3.0 will display the safety stop screen. In this video, we took you for a dive using the Oceanic Atom 3.0 dive computer. To learn more about the Atom 3.0, take the Atom 3.0 online specialty class at divecomputertraining.com. To practice with the Atom 3.0, use the eDiving Scuba Diving Simulator.